reading from the first book of Kings. Jeroboam left Jerusalem, and the prophet Ahijah, the Shilonite, met him on the road. The two were alone in the area, and the prophet was wearing a new cloak. Ahijah took off his new cloak, tore it into 12 pieces, and said to Jeroboam, Take ten pieces for yourself, the Lord God of Israel says. I will tear away the kingdom from Solomon's grasp and will give you ten of the tribes. One tribe shall remain to him for the sake of David, my servant, and of Jerusalem, the city I have chosen out of all the tribes of Israel. Israel went into rebellion against David's house to this day. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. God. I am the Lord your God. Hear my voice. I am the Lord your God. Hear my voice. There shall be no strange God among you, nor shall you worship any alien God. I, the Lord, am your God who led you forth from the land of Egypt. I am the Lord your God, hear my voice. My people heard not my voice, and Israel obeyed me not. So I gave them up to the hardness of their hearts. They walked according to their own counsels. I am the Lord your God, hear my voice. If only my people would hear me and Israel walk in my ways. Quickly would I humble their enemies against their foes I would turn my hand. I am, I am the Lord your God, hear my voice. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel. Jesus left the district of Tyre and went by way of Sidon to the Sea of Galilee, into the district of the Decapolis. And people brought to him a deaf man who had a speech impediment and begged him to lay his hand on him. He took him off by himself away from the crowd. He put his finger into the man's ears and spitting touched his tongue. Then he looked up to heaven and groaned and said to him, Ephatha, that is, be open. And immediately the man's ears were opened, his speech impediment was removed, and he spoke plainly. He ordered them not to tell anyone, but the more he ordered them not to, the more they proclaimed it. They were exceedingly astonished, and they said, he has done all things well. He makes the deaf hear and the mute speak. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. 